Hi guys, another quickie here. Uh, <coughs> I'm in copying mode, <laughs> as has probably been obvious with what I've been doing recently. Um, Tubal Kane made a very simple swarf chips collector. He used a piece of copper pipe and end caps. Well, I've got copper pipe and I've got two end caps, but one of them is too small. I think one must be metric, one must be uh, inches. Anyway, uh, had a look round, see what <laughs> usual. What have I got? So I got a piece of half-inch aluminum welded tube. It's not dimensionally very good in terms of diameter, but anyway, I've made a small brass plug for that end, thin plug, which is just a light press fit. And then for the business part, I found this brass threaded, it had something on the end here, I've got to put something back on there probably. Uh, eighth brass, bit of thread, found some nuts, put four neodymiums on, the ones with countersunk holes. And then for the top end, again for a, very, a light press fit, a little brass bush. So that goes, that goes down inside. And I've got to just give that a little tap with another piece of tube. That's basically it. I say we need a little knob on there probably. And then um, tubal cane, I used a piece of Delrin. Well, I've got a piece of about three inch and I'm not going to turn that down and <laughs> make a mess. I've just uh, taken a small off cut of brass long enough to put in the chuck and just made this sleeve. I had to centre pop it slightly to try and get an adequate adequate fit on here. Delrim would be better because it would probably grip a bit. But that basically is it. It's just uh, something to keep there to drop the chips. So simple as simple, simple as good. Oops, I really need to, need to just that needs to be just firmed up a little bit on there. Just pick that stuff up and then drop it off. All right. Useful for uh, small bits and pieces. All right, the other thing, another copy. And uh, somebody suggested I go to uh, look at Double Boost's channel, which I did. And that last double bearing centering thing I made, uh, he obviously, from all, by all accounts, had made one himself and used it a lot. That's the other thing he made. So I got a piece of 3 8 drill rod and uh, a bearing that I happen to have. And I'm going to try that out for uh, centering on the, on the mill put some black dots on there so I can see rotation. So we'll put that in the chuck or call it preferably. Take that up to an edge, see how it works out. All right, so I say more copying, but uh, all use for little gadgets. <laughs> Thanks for watching. All right, I ain't gone yet. <laughs> I just thought that last demo was pretty pathetic because I hadn't got many chips. Just see if I can get something else from uh, down on the tray here. There we are, that's a bit more useful, isn't it? A bit more useful. I'm overdue for a tidy up actually, so uh, long overdue. That's a reasonable amount. And the thing is, it does pick up the fine stuff. So, anyway, Again, thanks for watching. See you soon.